This is the second part of the series of mane and tails. We're going to be talking about the maintenance of the tail today. Um, Jasur has just come in from the presentation arena. Alex has knotted the tail so that it's not dragging on the ground as he comes in. And now he's going to show how what he does to maintain the tails in order to get these beautiful flowing tails on these lovely horses. Okay, so what we're going to do with him now, we're going to wash his tail and then we will show you how I'm going to put it up. So we want to remove all this sand he has on the end of the tail. Like usually he gets dirty after, after he gets uh, presented or shot. You can use normal shampoo. Second part, you can put a uh, conditioner. Okay, it's ready. Then uh, if you will uh, put it up now, so you can do it. So you can put a mineral oil, a little bit of uh, mineral oil. I mean, you don't need to put like a lot, but just a little bit here in the long hairs. then you can braid it. But make sure that like, you take all the long ones and let the, the short ones, the one you don't drag, all the long ones you can take and then make like three little bunches. Braid like really tight, but not loose either. Like something medium. You can do a little faster, it's fine. All the pinch your speed. I just slow because I'm a slow guy. And in the end. I have to soak my hand, it's kind of slippery. <coughs> Meaning will stay like that, and then you can put it here with the same tail. <coughs> you can you you cut it in half right there. That's why I told you don't make tight because otherwise it's going to be hard to put it in. See my ring in the middle, and then you can put it from here too. See from the bottom. 
again okay now you have part of it you can tie here okay and then you can put a guard test this is uh the product see it's a roll and it looks like a gas but it's a roll of guard, guard test Start from the bottom and you go to the side and you go in the middle and a couple gas here. Maybe you can do two or three gloves, all depends how big is the tail. Then you can cut it. Then when you cut it, you bend it here on the end. That way when you want to take it off, it's easy to find the end. And then you're gonna cover this is sack. This is the sack my boss use, but not used today. Okay, so you can cut it here in half. And you don't need to cut the whole way down, but it's uh, like three, three quarters of the bar. Then flip over. When you do this, it's really easy to put it inside because you put your arm inside, grab it, put it up for the front, outside, inside, both. Make sure you don't have this here. Take the tire and stay in here. Then you can tie it here. Tight. That way the sand or the dust doesn't get in the tail. See, it's ready to go. I think he's happy to be back in his stall. <laughs> That's a wrap.